Welcome back everybody. So guys in this class I just want to show you a, a very little piece of information about uh, this project we've made in a previous class. Actually, you know that how we are just getting the data of this input. We are just getting the data of this input by using this ID, the user input. And what we are doing, we are simply, you, you know that we are just making a variable here and we are just getting the ID through the get element by ID method. And here is, I'm, ju I'm just getting the value. And then here, I'm just sending that value. But I just need to get the value of that element every time. But there is another best way, the this dot value. If you remember that we just learned about that this keyword, I'm just going to show you, T-H-I-S, this. This keyword is actually for um, just simply this one. So there we can use that keyword again. Simply T H I S this and press point the period this dot value. Okay. Now what is the mean of this dot value? Means the value of this object or basically this input. Okay. I'm just sending the value of this input the value of this input through this inject this ajax function to the javascript okay on key up so now we just don't need to use this user input we can delete that and then exactly we can delete that too now save and go to the browser back this is a little simple and easy to do refresh the page and now i'm just typing here the brazil again and it's not working that means something's wrong go there and what is the issue here Oh yes, the issue is very simple that we're just still sending the user input which is not defined anywhere in the whole JavaScript. Basically what we need to do here, you know that we're just sending the data through the parameter. So here we just need to make a receiver of that value. So here I'm just making the, uh, the parameter. What I'm just making, I'm just typing here the user input. Okay, now I'm just making the variable here, okay, in the function in the parentheses of the function and here where is the value of this function where we're just calling the function we, we're just calling the function inside an input and the value we're getting the inputs value the inputs value through the fun ajax function okay so it's going there and here it's becoming a variable and then i'm assigning that variable i'm sending that variable through the var ones value as the var ones value through this uh, open request and we're just setting that to the process ajax.php now go to the browser and refresh the page and let's just check that out again the b-r-a-z-i-l the brazil in the, in the list okay so this is perfect something where i just want to clear you that if you just put the b as a small then it's not working because this is case sensitive don't forget that so guys in the next class we'll do something more interesting stay tuned and goodbye